Uh, well, Christy, I've got to say, I'm still just a little bit shaken. I was rushed by a crowd of protesters running in the opposite direction toward the outskirts of the square when uh, uh, there was a, a scuffle between protesters. Just a few minutes before, horses and camels came charging in. It was quite a surreal scene, I have to say. I was uh, then uh, sort of uh, glued up against the barrier. And at that point, one of the pro-Mubarak protesters came up to me, threatening me, telling me no, no, to get out of there. I was a little bit fearful. Another protester came to my aid, protected me, and said, don't touch her, she is with me. I gotta say, I might owe my safety right now to one of those protesters who decided to protect me at that point. Uh, it is absolutely chaotic right now down there. I reached pretty much the center of uh, the line where the anti and the pro Mubarak groups uh, had uh, reached a high point of tension. Some rocks a few minutes before had been thrown. Uh, I was uh, being told to move out of the way when the rush started. I then uh, had to join the group of protesters running in the opposite direction. I then ran as fast as I could, um, at that point fearing that I would get trampled, to be quite honest with you, and then got, again, uh, sort of uh, uh, plastered against one of the barricades, one of the sort of gates uh, leading out of the square, and ran as fast as I could all the way back to our live position. Uh, I'm fine, but I've got to say, this is a situation that can turn on a dime. There is a lot of anger coming from those protesters. Some of the, them seem intent on causing trouble, Christy. They are attacking journalists. If they see someone who looks Western, they're coming up to them and threatening them with violence. Uh, so this is the situation right now. I wasn't able to make it to the other side of the protest where the anti-government demonstrators have gathered. It really wouldn't have been prudent to go that far. So that is the situation from my vantage point, Christy.